Happy day two of Vlogmas. I hope you guys really enjoyed the first day. And if you didn't watch it, it's a 17 minute video from yesterday. I promise I'll try to make this one shorter because I said I was gonna have like five to 10 minute Vlogmas videos because these are gonna be in addition to my normal regular content. I'm still coming out with a haul video from that estate sale. You guys be watching for that. So these are just supposed to be in addition to my normal content. Um, so yeah, today is gonna be a little bit shorter. Let's see what happens today. It's so let's see what happens on day two of my Vlogmas, my Christmas as a reseller. Alrighty. Oh my gosh, I have to set you guys down and show you this super fun top that I bought. I got this at the estate sale and it's definitely giving me like vintage Gucci vibes. I can't find a brand on this, so I'm just gonna say that it's vintage Gucci. Does that does that work for everybody? Look at this here. Oh my gosh, I just think this is so beautiful. What a fun little detail. It's definitely wool, um, like a, some type of a wool blend. It's a little bit itchy, but it's worth it to wear today. And I have paired it with some vintage Levi's and a Gucci belt. Oh, and I have my um, Steve Madden like combat style boots on. Ready for today. Okay guys, I'm sitting down to a premiere of day one of the vlog here on my channel. I hope you guys are in the chat today. I definitely can't say every video is going to be a premiere, but I will premiere as often as I can and be in the chat. So you guys um, turn on notifications if you wanna be a part of that. If you like doing a live chat in the middle of the day, this one is happening at 10 o'clock central time. I tried to hit a time where folks on the west coast were already awake, but maybe folks on the east coast um, had some time to spend also. So 10 a.m. is where I landed and yeah, we're gonna premiere day one of the vlog. Hopefully you were watching this yesterday. It looks like Angie Dayton Valley Deals is already here and so is Courtney Bolo Buddies. I have a couple minutes. Um, it's only 9.53 so I have seven minutes. You guys think I could break down the boxes from yesterday in seven minutes? Um, I'm gonna go get my knife and see if I can get these things broken down really quickly. Hey, I put a pretty good little dent in them. It is 9.59, turning 10 o'clock right now. I got those broke down and then this stuff here. So I still have to break those down, but I gotta get on the premiere. Let me show y'all how much fun this is already. This is me without any sound. And this is my chat. Thank you guys for showing up and watching my video with no sound. Um, I'm gonna fix it and then I'll give advance notice and we'll go live. I have my tea, I have my phone, let's pull and pack some orders. The first item that I sold is actually not in my office, it's in this tote. You guys know how Lego obsessed I am and believe it or not, I have all of these Lego listed. Yeah, these were things that we either had duplicates of or um, I just bought just to resell. Um, so this is this huge Lego Ninjago, um, he's like a dragon. And I just sold this for $109 plus shipping. So the buyer's all in, I wanna say at like maybe 121. I'm not sure if shipping's gonna totally cover that or not. We'll see exactly how I do and where the buyer's at. So this bookshelf houses all of the books that I have for sale. And right now I'm looking for a Monsters Inc. book. And so like, let me just explain to you the organized chaos that is my life. There's a lot going on here. Haven't looked through these books yet, but I can see it from right now where I'm standing. It's this book, it's this Monsters Inc. book. <laughs> this is the one I'm looking for. So yeah, if you know your own inventory, you know your own inventory, right? This book you can see, I paid 50 cents for it. It just sold for $5.33 with free shipping. It's gonna take every bit of probably 350 to ship it. So I'm not gonna make much. Like, am I even doubling my money on this book? I'm not really sure. I didn't buy this book to sell. I bought it for my son and um, he read it until he didn't want it anymore. And so we sold it out of his closet. During Vlogmas day one, Abel um, from Abel's Treasures was in the live chat and he said he learned something and I thought, yes, I have to still be teaching you guys something in every single one of these. So here's the thing that I hope some of you are going to learn today. This is like a vintage wooden luggage rack. It just folds up, it collapses flat. This thing just sold for $52 plus the buyer paid $47.07 shipping. So the buyer is all in over $100 on this luggage rack and I think this cost me maybe $4 at the thrift store. The next item that sold is actually this, um, it's a cordless phone system. I paid a couple dollars for this, literally $2. This just sold for $75 plus $10 shipping. Anytime that you can find a cordless phone system, if it has additional handsets, and then if it has an answering machine, caller ID, those are all things to look for. Not every single one of them is a $75, $85 pickup, but this one was. So definitely run comps. 
Oh my gosh, I can't even believe that this sold. This was in yesterday's vlog. So we're going to be shipping out this orange cane and is this Harry or Lloyd? Which one wore the orange one? It's just like a dumb and dumber suit here. <laughs> we're just going to add this to the sold pile of things to ship today. The next thing that sold was a piece of jewelry and I have jewelry just, um, excuse me while I pull this out. Jewelry is just inside of this little crate for me and it's a set of two Lily Pulitzer bracelets that sold. Um, so I'll just look through here and dig out those two bracelets. That's, that one's Kate Spade. There they are. These, these two, sorry if that was really loud, Lily Pulitzer bracelets. Let's see what these sold for. Okay, it looks like these two bracelets sold for $18 plus $4.45 shipping. These sunglasses that sold, well, they're not really sunglasses. They're like a clip-on. Um, Solar Shield is the brand. And these sold for $9.95. Let me make sure that I have the right one. You see, these look really, really similar, but they're not the same. So one of them is 52 Rec 5 and the other is a 52 Rec 15. Let me see which one it was that sold. I don't want to ship the buyer the wrong item. It was the 15. So these sold for $9.95 with free shipping. I paid $1 for these retail arbitrage Walmart clearance. I thought it might have struck some type of VCR gold whenever I found this. Like it just looks straight out of the 80s, but this thing only sold for $30 and I kept it for a long time. $15 shipping on top of that. So um, I'm confident it could go $15 shipping even if it was cubic, um, like a cubic weight. I did bundle this up with a blank VHS. So I have a whole stack of blank VHS over here. Grab one of these and bundle it up with that. We have another book that sold. This is If You Take a Mouse to the Movies. Here it is. That didn't take too long. Okay, that did take a little minute, but it wasn't too bad. Then we have a men's polo shirt here that sold. Oh, that book, I forgot. I'm sorry, sold for $3.90 with free shipping. So I'm basically paying them to take it. And then this um, <laughs> this men's polo shirt sold for $29.95 plus shipping. The buyer's all in at like $60, I think, because they're paying for GSP shipping on this polo. Believe it or not, I sold something over on Poshmark. So let's see what it is. It is a Calvin Klein hoodie. Um, so yeah, let me get this out. Calvin Klein's are size large. Oh yeah, I was kind of thinking about keeping this hoodie. Well, not now. So here's everything that needs to go out today. I've already missed the mail and I have some other things to do before I need to pick up my kids. It's already that time almost. So um, I'm not gonna film boxing all of this. It's not interesting to me anyway. So I don't know that it, why it would be super interesting to you. The most interesting thing would maybe be the VCR. Um, yeah, if there's something, something cool happens, I'll let you know. Otherwise you're about to see all these packages miraculously bagged in box. I love it when a plan all comes together. I went upstairs and grabbed this box. Um, side note, it has been hailing outside. That's crazy. Anyway, this box is the exact size of this VCR. So I'm gonna box it inside this box, cut this down, and then put that inside of another box. Let's get it all boxed. I just got really scared, you guys. I thought, I thought that Vlogmas was gonna be over by the time that I wrapped that luggage rack. Okay, it seriously took me like, I'm gonna say half an hour to 40 minutes. It was ridiculous and the box still is not that beautiful and it's getting shipped out. Look at this, here is the, if you take a mouse to the movies, sold for $3.90. And then let me come over here and show you guys. <laughs> it's $3.19 to ship it. There's no money in children's books unless you have something valuable or you lot them up. Just say no. Okay, so the hat and cane combo, I'm mailing in two separate boxes. The buyer paid $12 to ship it. I mailed the cane in a priority mail, like long um, tube mailer, and that cost $7.69. And then I am going to input the buyer's address into pirate ship and sip, ship the hat separately. Okay, it is an additional $8.49 to mail the hat. And so that might seem steep. You know, they only paid $12, but that is like $16 combined. And there's not a chance I could mail that huge box with that cane and space for the hat for 16 bucks. Look, I changed and I didn't even add additional weight. I kept it at one pound, which is what the cane was. And this is the length of the cane. This is the width of the hat. And this is the height of the hat. Um, so it would have been $33.55. 
even even UPS and FedEx don't have cheaper options than mailing it in two separate boxes via USPS. I'm loading up all the packages in the car and I'm like sweaty. This sweater's super cute, but I have just been running around like a crazy lady this morning. I already have 3,000 steps in and all I've really done is ship. Anyway, it's a lot warmer outside than I thought it was gonna be today. My husband warned me it was gonna be warm. Hey Google, what's the weather outside? Currently in Dexter, it's 61 degrees and partly cloudy. 61 on December 1st, 61 degrees. That's Okay, everything is loaded up in the car. It's December 1st and I have it on good authority that my son's elf is coming back from the North Pole today. So I'm excited to see what's gonna happen. Um, I feel like I might need to spend a little bit of time preparing before I go pick up the kids because I think that he's gonna be back today. So if your kids have an elf or if your kids are watching, how exciting is it when the elves come back and then every morning when you wake up, you get to see what mischief they got into. We really, really enjoy that around here and these elves get crazy. So yeah, um, I, wonder, I wonder what kind of weird thing that they'll be doing today. Whoa, I was outside loading up the packages and someone broke in the house, this guy and his friend and they brought a tree for Israel to decorate when he gets out of school. Isn't that adorable, these little miniature ornaments? Oh man, Israel's gonna have the time of his life with this. So if you guys can't already tell, we have kind of a go-go lifestyle. As vegans, everyone always asks, how do you get your protein? But these are two supplements that to me are more important being vegan than um, trying to supplement protein because you get plenty of that. I need to supplement B12. This puts me in a good mood and gives me energy and iron. Oh my gosh, if I am not supplementing with iron um, because I, I have kind of low iron as it is and then, you know, being vegan, like... I definitely need this. Anyway, these two things help me get through my day and our go, go, go lifestyle. Not sponsored or anything, although um, if a vitamin company wants to sponsor me, I'm here for it. I am in line to get the kids in these glasses that were pretty um, controversial over on my Instagram. I think the majority of people said they did not like these glasses, so you guys comment below. Tell me if you like these glasses. I found these at Goodwill in Troy, Illinois. <laughs> anyway, I'm here to pick up the kids and then we're gonna see the elves! There's a lot of stuff on my fodder. There is? Yep. Israel. Do you see this tree? Yeah. I saw that. Come I around see. come around this way. Two L's? I'm gonna tell my hair this. Oh my goodness! The elves! Our elves! The elves are Our here. Our elves! Oh my gosh, look, they brought all these Christmas ornaments for you? Yeah. And Della. Wow, look at this one. Oh yeah. Look at this. You gonna decorate this tree and put it in your room? Yeah. This one, I think this one is mine. I think these ornaments are mine. Oh my gosh, I have an offer on this Santa Claus that I listed uh, yesterday. You guys saw me list this. It says the offer is $140 plus $12 shipping. This isn't even the American flag one. This is just, oh, he's so beautiful. I don't know. My immediate response is to take it right away. I listed it at $180. Um, I feel like... I should probably take it right away. I mean, what's another 40 bucks even if it sat there a little bit longer? I paid $20 for this, guys. And I even asked folks in the chat during the premiere, would you have paid $20 for this? And people were like, probably not. A $140 offer. Should I take it? Should I take it? Let's just do it. 
Okay, now back to what I was actually doing. Drew Profit Monsters is doing Vlogmas also. You guys, I just saw this. You can see I'm almost done with the video. He was just talking about, hey, if you watch it to the end. So I got to see what it is that I'm supposed to do if I watch it to the end. But I am going to post a link to um, Drew Profit Monsters in the description. You guys go check that out. If you're liking a reseller Vlogmas, he is doing reseller Vlogmas also. I haven't seen any other resellers doing it yet, but I'm super excited about this. So let's see what else it is that he has to say. So when I went to the post office, I checked my P.O. box and I got some happy mail. I'm so excited about um, my friend Leanne, who is random chick picker on Instagram and on YouTube, sent me something special. I have to show you guys. She said she saw this and just immediately thought of me and I'm, I'm stoked about it. Let me show you what it is. Leanne, all I can say is thank you for being a friend. <laughs> it's a stay golden and it has the golden girls on it. Oh my gosh. This is so amazing. I love it. Let's try it on with these. Uh, I don't know. These jeans are a little light, so we won't judge it with these jeans, but let's try the sucker on. And if you threw a party, <laughs> I love it. Thank you so much, Leanne. Well, I am gonna crank out about 20 listings just to let you guys know listing-wise what I am doing today. And I think I'm gonna stop the vlog here just because I promise that these vlogs will be a little bit shorter. Asking you to watch them daily is a lot. Um, so I'm aiming at closer to 10 minutes and yesterday's was 17. I talk too much, so <laughs> that's it. I'm not saying anything else except for to watch for the estate sale haul video because like I said, the vlogs are gonna be in addition to my regular content. But thank you guys so much for watching. Um, comment below a Christmas tree. If there's a Christmas tree emoji and just to let me know that you watched till the end of the vlog. God bless you guys. Thanks so much for watching. And remember, treat your business like your business. Alrighty. <laughs>